have a very wild puppy this morning. Who are you? Where are you going? Where are you going? Come back here. Come back here. Give me that thing. Um, no, don't bite his butt. Don't bite his little butt. You're biting his butt. You're biting his butt. That's not very nice. That's not very nice. Oh, no. Don't bite his little butt. That hurts. That hurts. You're so cute. Okay, so I just did my grocery shopping. I got that done. I got some laundry in. Um, now I'm headed home. I think I'm gonna try to get my car washed because before we left to go to Miami, they had like salted the roads for snow and so I have a black car and it's like covered in salt and I feel like I need to wash it. Um, so I'm gonna try to go do that now. And then unload all of our groceries. I'm out of breath because I'm out of shape. <laughs> I just like ran to the car and threw everything in there. So I'm gonna try to do that and go home and unpack the groceries and get everything straight for the week. It's 420. So I really wanna just be able to relax. It's Super Bowl Sunday, which I don't really, I don't know, I don't have a huge desire to watch the Super Bowl, but I feel like, I don't know, everyone I know is watching it. So like I feel like if I don't watch it, I'm missing out on conversation topics, but I don't really know. <laughs> okay, so it's a little bit dark outside, so I have a ton of lights on in here. So hopefully the lighting is okay. But I just wanted to share like a little Whole Foods haul, I guess, with you guys what I picked up. Um, so I can't decide if this is gonna be a separate video. I always say that, but it like just ends up being too long. But I'm gonna go really quick. Um, a lot of these things are things I buy every week, so I'll definitely let you know what I generally buy. And then some of them, I'm trying a couple of new recipes, and so they're things that I wouldn't usually buy. I also always buy oat milk, but like the past month, they have been completely out at our Whole Foods. And I don't know if it's just the day that I'm going or they're not restocking it, but it makes me so sad. Anyways, I always buy this laundry detergent. This is what I wash all of our stuff in. This definitely leaked, but it's just a naked rotisserie chicken. I'm gonna wipe that up. Um, I also have just like some plain white bread. Jay uses this for sandwiches and I do too. I also oops, got this Glutino gluten-free bread. I haven't tried this one, but I usually use their um, English muffins and I really like those. So I decided to do this because I like doing like a fried egg with cheese and um, some veganese for breakfast. So I just would use one slice of this. So I'm gonna try that one out. I'll let you know what I think. I got some unsweetened shredded coconut for a recipe, some ginger, because I like adding a little bit of ginger with hot lemon water. Um, Flaxseed, because I was out. I usually don't buy that every week. Bananas, I usually get bananas every week, organic bananas. These are also things that I don't always buy. The maca powder and matcha powder, because I was out of those. I needed to get some of those. Garbanzo beans, I was thinking about making some hummus. Um, turmeric, because I've seen a lot of people talking about turmeric, how it's good for your skin. Um, what is this? I lost my mind. Oh, a shallot. I also got two organic avocados, because I like having them in my smoothies and for like with an egg in the morning um, or just with recipes in general. Got some organic baby bella mushrooms. I love buying these kind. Oh, sorry, it's upside down. This kind, I love buying. They're just really good, they're my favorite, and I will put them with chicken or with steak. I'll saute them, they're just really good. Um, a great thing to have, I like the way they taste. Also, the pasture-raised organic Vital Farms eggs. These are my favorite eggs, hands down. I got some dill for a recipe, I usually don't buy dill. I also bought um, some rice cauliflower. I've tried this before and I didn't love it a few years ago, but I have been making some progress, so I thought I would give it another shot and maybe you try to do like a fried rice kind of thing versus like, I think last time I just steamed it and tried to eat it as like white rice. That was a no-go. Um, I was happy to see that they had organic, because I always try to buy organic, but this is just oven roasted turkey breast. I got this for Jay, he likes to make sandwiches. Of course, I had to get some frozen rice. I usually buy frozen white rice, but I tried to do the brown rice um, this time. I love these, they're frozen rice bags, organic. Um, it is 20 ounces and they're $2.99. I just don't feel like, I feel like that's just not a bad price. Um, tahini, like I said, I am hoping to make some hummus. I've got some organic bacon because I usually 
um, buy bacon. I will make us like BLTs, um, just other things. I really like bacon and I use it to like season green beans and stuff like that. Some organic boneless skinless chicken thighs because I like using those to cook with and organic drumsticks. You'll see there's a whole lot of chicken. My whole family makes fun of me because I eat so much chicken. I also bought these mini cucumbers. These are not organic, but they didn't have any mini organic ones. Um, I saw this, I have this recipe in the new um, Gwyneth Paltrow cookbook, Clean Plate, The Clean Plate. I think that's what it's called or something like that. And it was like pickled cucumber, so I really wanted to try that. I also got some Italian parsley for a recipe. I got our favorite yogurt that we always eat. I love brown cow yogurt. It's my favorite yogurt because it is just like, it's so creamy. It has the cream top and it's just the chocolate. So good, it's really good. Um, I also got, I repurchased the chocolate cookies and cream cashew milk if you saw this on my Instagram. It is so good. This is like ice cream, but it's made with cashew milk, which is so much better, I think, than like the coconut milk ones. I accidentally bought the coconut milk ones and I just didn't like it. And you know, I drink coconut milk in my coffee all the time, but the cashew milk to me is the most, like the closest thing to real ice cream. Ice cream does not agree with me. I just eat it on occasion, but this, I can eat it like, oh, it's so good. I also got two salmon fillets for Jay and I and some baby spinach. I always put this in my smoothies in the morning. I'll just like put a whole chunk in that. Um, and that's it. That's all I got for this week. We're gonna be eating a lot of chicken and we'll probably get some takeout one night or more. We tend to eat a lot of takeout. So now I have to put all this in the fridge and do more laundry. Also, I thought I would mention, I always like to clean out our fridge generally. I cleaned out a whole bunch of it before I put more in and like just get rid of everything like leftovers that we like have eaten off of and we're just not gonna eat anymore. I'll just throw everything out um, that needs to be thrown out. We have a big cake because this was from my birthday party. <laughs> okay, I got everything put away. I really need to do like a fridge clean out. Just, I don't understand. Like I have so many things that like, n I just need them, but I don't use them every day and it's like awful. Um, I have a, like a real jelly olive relish thing going on and mustards are my thing too. I love mustard. <laughs> So I don't really share things I don't like that often because I don't want to be like a Debbie Downer and everybody is different, but I don't want to constantly be sharing things that I love so that you think I'm just trying to sell everything, but these I really didn't care for. And I don't know why because I have like a recipe of chocolate. I think that's why, honestly. I think I just don't like them because I like the ones I make better, but these were just really dry. What do you think about these, Jay? Uh, yeah, they were, they were so dry. And I'm pretty sure that the chocolate um, muffins that I make are considered vegan too. And these were just like, they're going in the trash because they were like no good. But the ones I make are Delicious. from the Sweet Laurel cookbook. And they're really good. 